two wine connoisseurs, man. We back, man. I was on a vacation for a little while. I had to go down south real quick, get myself bulked up a little while. You know what I'm saying? Breathe that fresh country air. But I'm tired of that now, man. It's, you know what? I'm a New York dude. I need some cement, man. When I go to sleep at night, I need to hear, like, horns and people yelling and all types of shit like that. So that's what it is, man. Two wine connoisseurs. We back. And this is Brooklyn edition. This is the... Carmelo Anthony edition, St. John's edition, and the Beat Miners edition. Understand that this is real big. Understand that these are my dudes. They always look out for me, man. So I said today, I'm going to look out for them, man. We're going to have a little wine today. You know what I'm saying? Well, man, Sam graciously blessed us with the establishment at Lily. You understand what I'm saying? And this is the Lebanese spot. You understand? There's no pork in here. No pork on the fork. We're going in there. We got the Messiah right here. That's made in the Becca Valley. You understand that? The Becca Valley Google that. Understand? The B minors is here. I'm going to let them introduce themselves. I'm just saying, I'm just happy to be here. You know, usually, usually we eat strange animals. But right here, this looks very scrumptious. Yeah. I am swore the B minus, B minus radio, B minus.com, all types of flavor right here. <laughs> Yo, this is DJ Wayne Ski. I'm here to uh, drink the wine. Definitely. <laughs> drink it up, baby. Drink. That's what I'm here to do. If you need some of the good food, we're going to get it. Hey, I'm even D. Wayne Ski called me on the phone and said free liquor, so I just showed up. Straight off the plane. Off the plane today. That's dedication right there. That's dedication. Y'all family. That's what it is. This ain't Jesus type day. This ain't Jesus type day. Yo, I can't make it. I'm on the plane. Yeah, that's what it is. That man made that dedication, man. So I'm going to eat this steak tongue today. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that man made that dedication, man. So I'm going to eat this steak tartare in order, in honor of my man Evil D. And someone said, consider it. An extra rare hamburger. There it is. Top dog, an extra rare hamburger. That's These guys good. are large. These guys right here. In Hollywood. I'm just happy to be here. <laughs> That's all. I'm just happy to be here. You know what I'm saying? I'm starting, I'm starting off with this red today. You understand? What else this we red? got on the table here? Oh, man, we got a couple of things. We got, we got gold and we got the silver. You oh, understand? Yeah. That's the platinum. That's the silver. The platinum. 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 Silver. Platinum. Oh, my bad. My bad. <laughs> platinum. And this is Messiah. Which, what, which I what was that, Twilight? Yes. Twilight. Twilight. Messiah is a Twilight, you understand? We're going to drink this today. There's a couple of bottles here. We got the food rolling. And we're just going to have a good time. Like I said, man, we was gone for a minute. When I was gone, I seen a lot of imitators was coming out. Like, somebody even asked us. They was like, yo, can, can, can I do a true wine kind of sort? Negative. Negative. <laughs> 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 man, you can rock like that. No. It's the original right here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Crazy, Definitely. Two wine connoisseurs, we'll tell. So now that you know, thanks out to my man Mikey Boy at Wine Bowl. He's always looking out for us, man. The big plus on that. And we're going to drink, man. We're going to go on today. We're going to have a lot of fun. And big shout out to my man Ben who came from the Village Voice. Definitely. Right. Definitely. That's right. Whatever Charlie Sheen is doing now, yeah, Old Dirty yeah. did that yeah. first. Triple <laughs> Old Dirty had the original Tiger's yeah. Blood, son. Yeah. Old Dirty was first. Yeah. Yeah. Old Dirty yeah. That's what he's doing. Yeah. <laughs> Charlie, you know, Charlie is doing a lot of shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, <laughs> boy, Charlie is going against the system right now. Yeah. Yeah. No, he is. He's yeah. yeah. with that dude, though. Got tiger blood. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm getting high. I'm a winner. <laughs> yeah, I think I said he was doing seven grand rocks at a time. Wow, wow. that guy's incredible. <laughs> seven <laughs> grand rocks. They say though, when he comes to work, like when he has to actually work, like he works, man. He works. Works. Yeah. Like, it's, it's crazy, man. He's a functioning high dude. Exactly. He's just a functioning <laughs> high dude. <laughs> I like that term. That's a new term that I'm looking at. Functioning high dude. Yeah, Point by evil me. Functioning high dude. Yeah, I like that. In the world of crap, five dollars can take you anywhere. Oh yeah. That's the startup, man. That's the startup. Like, for instance, my man Fingers, putting them avenue. He started working on my car one day. It was a blizzard outside. And, and I started to go to a real mechanic, but dudes was like, fingers, fingers. I let him start rocking, he got he got too high during the day. Left my joint on the jack overnight. I seen him the next day, chased him with my boots on. Cause I happened to be early in the morning, I seen him out the window and I was like, I'm gonna get him now. Soon as he see me, he ran. I chased him, almost slipped, I caught him, smacked him up. Walking away from him, felt bad, turned around, gave him $5. You know what I'm saying? I felt bad because I did that. And, and, and in my mind, that's all he wanted. You know what I'm saying? Because he's used to get beat up anyway. Wow. So, the $5 I gave him, that was the start. Huh? Hey, listen, the key word to avoid all this, 
fingers. That's the thing. <laughs> fingers. <laughs> fingers and crack? That don't even matter. Look, it's not even working. <laughs> Listen, a lot of people say crack messed up the community. I think crack evolved the community. <laughs> because, <laughs> because we were getting stuff for a low price. <laughs> when I was coming up, they were selling DJ equipment for dirt cheap. <laughs> no. Listen, guys, Charlie Sheen's on crack. That's he's what he's smoking. Crack. Seven gram rocks. Yes, he's, he's smoking crack. crack rock. Tiger blood. He's on the cheapest <laughs> form of that shit you can get on the street. But right he's now. on the crack. He got Adonis blood. He got. He's on the crack that don't. You don't lose your money. Yeah. Cause he's not losing his money. He's trying to get more money. Cause he's a functioning crackhead. Oh, okay. So he's getting high. Charlie boy, he's a functioning get high. What did I say? <laughs> A functioning, functioning high dude. A functioning <laughs> high dude. He is a functioning high dude because it's a lot of a lot of dudes that I know in the industry that yo they just get so high, but then they do their work and they're incredible. Yeah, it's crazy, man. And that's Charlie's one of them, boy. I can't do yeah. that no more. Yeah, I can't work with the. You see, you can't do that no more. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, that's a good high. No, I can't. Like back in the days when we was coming in the game, we would have to wait for dudes to take like three hour, whatever high break you take, you know what I'm saying, to do vocals. I can't do that. Can't do, that. <laughs> <laughs> do what you gotta do before you come to the crib. We gotta go smoke for a minute and oh. come back and listen that smokers break. Mr. Walt, that beat is hot. Okay, I'm gonna write to it. But give me three hours to smoke whatever I gotta smoke, and then I'm gonna be good. There you go. So, well, no, well, speaking on that note, these brothers in here, first of all, I gotta let people know, man, just they body of work, man. Well, you, and our, your brother, y'all explain the body of work behind y'all. You know, we, we, we beat miners, you know, Black Moon into the stage. Who the hell are they? Yeah, who the hell are they? <laughs> the Shining, Smith & Wesson, Helter Skelter, you know, OGC, the whole boot camp clip. But the great Sadat X, you know, yeah. we've been in and out on records. Definitely. You know? That's, it's, it's, it's a grown tradition. Naughty by Nature, Busta Rhymes, Eminem. And the list just goes on and on. You know, we just try to, try to stay busy, you know. We, we love hip hop. This is what we do. And then we also have Beat Miners Radio. You know. There you go. With this guy right here, Wayne Ski. Yeah, that guy. Hello. He's the. What beast. you up to these days, Wayne? Oh man, I'm all over the place. First and foremost, you know what I'm saying. Grew up off these guys. Shout to DJ Bizarro. Couldn't be here. Yeah. You know, I know Bass for a thousand years. The other half of the Booze Brothers. Right. Right. The other half of the Booze Brothers. Okay. Getting busy on the Booze. That's what's up, man. And it just goes to show, man. Like, you know, these is brothers, man. That's that that that's in my. I mean, this is like the essence of hip hop, man. You know, this, this is this is what I like, man. You know what I'm saying? And I'm and I'm glad to see, man, that it, that it's still roads and venues for them to do what they do, man, and get it out there, man. And it just shows, man, that everybody has not gone to the other side, man. We still got soldiers on this side, man. That's why I love these dudes to death. If you hear no they doubt. show, they still play real joints. Oh yeah, yeah. definitely. I yeah, we do. We have to. We have to. We gotta. We gotta keep it going. It ain't no cookie cutter radio show. Nah, much, nah. Right? We gotta. We gotta reach out for everybody in the whole nine. But right. you know, majority of the music we play is our music. It's, it's our music. You know it's what the saying? music that we like. But we definitely, we 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 definitely raise the bar. Like you might log on one day and catch me playing some electronica. Like that's what we do. Like it's all about mm -hmm. elevating the game. But the roots. What they put down, with what the X put down, with what fucking Wall and E put down. That's the foundation of the station. That ain't gonna never change. Never. But you gonna still hear shit, cause you know DJs work. That's what it is. A DJ ain't closed minded. That's right. There you go. That's right. And on another note, I don't know what these things are right here, <laughs> but I'm gonna take some of these to go. <laughs> Very good. And I'll tell you one what thing. What do we have here? It's good. This is, these are the signature dish. This is our Brussels sprouts. They are uh, tossed with a fig jam, sherry vinegar, a little bit of minted yogurt, and walnuts and grape garnish on uh, the plate. They are phenomenal. Cool. Here we have a uh, crispy warm eggplant, uh, and that is chopped, uh, sauteed in a tamarind uh, uh, molasses sauce. Wow. Nice. 
Mm. You have your falafel, falafel yeah. um, mm. the chickpea dumplings um, with the tahini sauce, and a little bit of a tabbouleh salad, uh, garnish with the plate. Oh, oh yeah, it's going down it's here, bro. Tell you, there's a lot of uh -oh. food on two wine console, and I have no problem going in on a baby cow, yo. Tear <laughs> down, boy. Believe it. I love the kids, but I eat a baby cow down. <laughs> <laughs> boy. Yep. Okay. So the proper way is you take the dumplings. Take the dumplings. Um, and you. I'm gonna try to say it as politely as possible. I'm no, say it rudely. <laughs> say it rudely. Don't be scared. Alex isn't around. Okay, you take the balls. You take Whoa! The balls. <laughs> <laughs> and then you sport the uh, the white stuff. Hey! I'm not having that one. I know how to handle it. And then some cigarettes. And the world goes around it. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, and it's a wonderful like explosion. Yes. So secure in your masculinity, we have no problem. Okay, let's, let's, let's see this. Hold up. What did we get ourselves in? Exactly. Uh, you filming? Oh, yeah, I'm filming. All right, now check it out. She explained to me. I'm first of all, I'm secure in my masculinity. I'm gonna let y'all know that off the bat. You understand? She said you take the balls and you put it in your mouth and you squirt the white stuff. This is what she said. Understand? I'm, I'm gonna try and understand. This is just food right here, so we don't go like that. Can we use take a fork? It, you know. something in my mouth, the balls, it was a little strange, but it's all right, though. It's good. It's good. It's I think they have to get us. <laughs> they have to get us. That's right. what it is. No. Is this some sort of setup? No. That good first date appetizer. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah, this, 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 that's certainly, definitely something yeah. you want to bring a first Yo, what is it? What, what? I'm definitely I, secure with mine, you know what I'm saying? Word up. Yo, what is in that tube, though? That's what I'm looking at. I'm trying to figure out. What's in the tube? It's like it's no, like a meatball no, no, no. with a test tube attached to that shit. All right, let me, let me try this right here. Yeah, it's, it's not bad. You squirt the joint. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of strange. Yeah, it's good. It's good. <laughs> What's in it? Hey, man. Yo, where's the, where's the, where's the wagers again? What is it, yogurt sauce or something? Yeah. It's a minted yogurt, yes. Minted yogurt. Minted yogurt sauce. <laughs> Even that sounds strange to me saying yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> no, you can't go around the way talking about, yeah. yo, I ate minted yogurt, son. And I squirted it in my mouth with yeah. the ball. You know what I'm saying? You know what It worked, though. It worked. No, that man. It's all right, man. See, now, the whole, the whole idea with that is when you're on your first date with a girl, you bring her here, and okay. you go, yo, we got squirty, we got squirty burger things going on, and, you know. <laughs> you put it in the mouth and you squeeze. Yeah, that's We got squirty balls. We got squirty, balls. squirty burger. Hey, baby, you want some squirty balls? <laughs> <laughs> but check it out, though. Look, look at the setting that we have. First of all, once again, I got to give a shout out to my man Sam for having us in this establishment. It's got the Lebanese theme, the Middle Eastern theme. And, you know, it, it just feel like this is the type of spot you, like, I feel like a sheik right now. You understand? Like, like, this is like, like Lawrence of Arabia or somebody like that, like I'm in here, we having a meeting of the minds, you know, a harem spot, you know, I can't talk too much, the ladies just say that. But uh, it's cool though, man, I'm, I'm feeling this vibe once again, man, I gotta give a shout out to, to, uh, to Sam, and if y'all down here, if y'all in the city, come to a uh, Lily, right? Yeah, Sam, Lily. Right, Lily, come here on 5th Ave, 27th and 5th, right on the corner, you can't miss it, man, it's a, it's a nice spot. Right nice. next to a bingo hall and uh, right next to the dice where they shoot the dice. Bingo hall and the dice. <laughs> Right. There we go. Watch, 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 watch. Oh yeah, that's right. It that's is. right. Yeah, here come the camera. See, <laughs> see, it all adds up. You see, it all, it all makes they, sense. they put meat, squirty meatball nuts and um, <laughs> yes, the sex museum across the street. Aphrodisiac yeah. type of foods. That's my new word for the day. Aphrodisiac <laughs> type of foods, and I, I'm gonna rock with that. Got the wine, you know, and also you can't forget. Whenever we do the true wine connoisseurs, we gotta have the effed up factor. You understand? And yeah. This, what, what, what's the wine we drinking? First of all, this is this is the red right here, the Messiah. Understand? And it's a red man, and, and it's smooth. It's going well with the food, mm -hmm. and it, it's not a, it's, it's not too heavy. 
Right. You understand? And it's not, it, it doesn't feel, well, any wine, if you drink in excess, you're going to get twisted. <laughs> but this is this is the type of thing, man, I could, I could drink a couple of glasses of this and feel yeah. comfortable going home, feel comfortable driving. Don't drink and drive. It's public service now. Drink and drive. <laughs> drink and drive as long as you, as long as <laughs> you know where the hell you're going. <laughs> 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 Just don't get caught. Yeah, don't get caught. Don't get caught. You ain't drinking drive, drive if you ain't get caught. You can drive drunk. Just don't get caught. There you go. That's it. And I'm gonna, there I'm you gonna, go. I'm going to try one more of these for GP. I'm going I'm to give the audience. Check this out. This is the joint. No homo. This is the joint. I'm, I'm going to tell everybody where he's going. You saw that? Flames, but it's good. <laughs> Wayne, you up, son. Come on. You up, son. I knew he was going to do that. You up, yeah. son. All right, I'm a good sport. <laughs> You know? And I, I hope these are one time only thing. Like, you don't, you don't have that squirt that you throw away. Like, you know, okay. You're not going to refill with that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Mama! That's pretty good. Ain't that bad? That's really good. All right, let me try it. Let me try it. All right, here we go. Oh. This don't really look right. <laughs> Right. I'm gonna shuffle, shuffle, so it's not, not hard. They all mixed up. Walt, you should get every one of these motherfuckers right. <laughs> I know you're gonna get every last one right. Alright, we'll, right, we'll, right. we'll start off kinda easy. Alright, all right. Mr. Walt, mm -hmm. who produced Akinelli's debut album, Vagina Diner? Ding, ding, ding! I got a drink. No more cup. Went straight from the bottom. Straight from the bottom. Wow. wow. There we go. We, we go. We're getting the hood right now. Okay. Sadat X. Yes. Wow. You up. In 1991, what rapper told fans to be a father to their child? That was Ed OG. Bing, bing, bing. Definitely. That's my dude right there. <laughs> All right. All right, DJ Wayne Ski. Yeah! <laughs> R&B singer Michelle has kids by two different West Coast hip hop personalities. Mm. Who are they? <laughs> I know one. Do, 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 do. Right? That's one. Was it the DJ name? No. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> the DJ name. Okay. <laughs> it's actually Shug Knight. Uh, Shug. Uh, wow. Shug. I didn't know that one. Nah, no, that's yeah. I Remember, he took the picture. He took the yeah. picture of Death Row. We Not take just care that, of our family. She claimed a child support claim against Shug Knight to get child support. We take care of our family. We with take the care of our family. Oh, family. oh yeah. 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 Wow. All right. Next question. Uh -huh. What was Snoop Dogg's first rap name? Wow, he don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> he don't know that. Drink, you might as well drink. Pass the bottle. Might as well. Bow Wow Woof Woof, I don't know. His first rap name was called Super Duper Snoop. <laughs> you know what? I'm glad he came. Yeah, all right. Let's go. Grand opening, grand yeah. Yo, check it out. This is Sadat X, True Wine Connoisseurs. And I'm here with the man himself, my man Sammy. This is the guy who gave us the wine. He he graciously, you know what I'm saying, sent the wine for us to do the episode with. He got the smooth accent too. Look at him, we got that smooth style, that lemonade <laughs> style, that's real smooth. The Becker Valley, like I said, the Messiah, the wine is coming from the Becker Valley. Understand my man Sammy is smooth. Look at him right there. Smooth, smooth as hell. He does. He does. <laughs> he does. He walk in okay. smooth. He walks in wait, smooth. Wait, wait, hear him talk. He'll be like, ah, da, 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 da. Watch him. He walks in smooth. He's automatic. <laughs> Some wine to wind up, catch up with you guys. <laughs> See, look at that. Real smooth. Like, catch up to us. I need some wine to catch up. <laughs> like, real smooth. I gotta take a lesson from Sandy, boy. Flew in from Beirut, just now. Wow. Wow. That's great for this. Yeah, pretty much where winemaking started, actually, the Beka Valley. Thousand, thousand meters from sea level, uh, Eastern Mediterranean. Snow capped mountains, we're just skiing and snowboarding there now actually. Mm. No uh, no need to irrigate all year round. Wines are pretty much organic. We have um, an average of 280 days of sunshine a year. 
Phoenicians, our ancestors, were the first people to ship wines to the pharaohs of Egypt, then to the Greeks, then to the Romans, and they've planted vines all the way to Spain, uh, around the Mediterranean basin, so that's not even old world, that's ancient world, so we wrap it here, bring it to you, it's Masaya. That's uh, all uh, Mediterranean varietals, that's um, Cabernet Sauvignon, uh, predominantly, with some Syrah and Morved. This is Grenache, medium-bodied wine, full-bodied wine. And that's how we roll. Ooh, that's yeah. what oh, and you see, you see, that's how we roll, son. <laughs> Yo, and, and you notice how he said that that's where wine making started. You see, right. he threw that in there. So all, everybody else, the, the French dudes and the Spain dudes, he said this is where the wine making started. So he's holding down where he's from. Tradition. And, 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 and I, gotta, I, gotta, I gotta rock with that, man. You understand right. what I'm saying? He right. still behind his people 100%. That's where wine making started. My man Sammy said it, and that's what it is. Word up. Two Cheers. wine connoisseurs. Cheers. 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 Mm. So that's the Eric. Wow. That looks like the Eric. That's 100% 100, 100 proof. Ooh, wow. I see why we got the water now. <laughs> Yo, Walt, you gotta do a straight shot to that. You might want to film that. Look at yeah, that. You might want to film that. I've been filming. Ooh. And real, real so smooth that's, with his. He's real smooth with it. That's a white variety is called a baby. We distilled it three times. Wow. Over ancient stills with the. Uh, over firewood embers, then we add anise, let it macerate for 18 oh, hours. World bread right there, boy. Bread Tell of man. Jesus time. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Age of two years in clay, I'm four in jars. Wow. Here you go. Yeah. Wow. That's tough. I'm scared oh, you, Look at the mixture. All of a sudden, like, boom, bang. Like Sammy did yeah, something and crazy. twisted and... <laughs> wow, boy. I must say, all right. Drink of the lions, we call it. I'm gonna wait till everybody gets there. What y'all gonna toast to, man? Milk, milk of the lions. Milk of the lions. Wow. Understand that. This is going back to them days when when it was real out there. Understand how Sammy mixed that up. Like, the scientist. His new name is Sammy the Scientist, right? There. <laughs> no doubt. The Alchemist. The Alchemist. I read that. The Alchemist. It's a great book. The Alchemist. One love, job love. <laughs> yes. I have a glass there. Wow. I'll pass that down. Now this is this is it like has a, a licorice smell to it. Yeah. Too much of this. This is the lay down right here. This will lay you down. <laughs> this will lay you down. It won't be the itis. You be laid down. I don't I wanna know what the FUF is on this one. Yeah, this one is it's gonna be high, Mikey. The FUF on this one AKA. a little high. AKA the Drink one. Drink in moderation. The one, two, three, you pin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ain't getting up. <laughs> no, you ain't gonna chef it up. That's the chef. Why are you not drinking? I'm okay. waiting for everybody to get theirs first and then we have a toast and drink. No? You're polite. Yeah, yeah. I'm polite. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, pull up, yo, sit down. Where you got your etiquette, son? No, I'm polite, like man. That, 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 right. I like how that happens right there. Yeah, bro. yeah, that's that's crazy. For all your street chemists and everything, that's the chemist right there. That's the, the chef chemist. right there. Take that to the table. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 so we good now. Yep.